It's a very good afternoon to you all are watching NTV and uh, we're coming to you live from uh, Lamo district. Uh, this is the main trading center or the town here in uh, Lamo district after very many kilometers uh, as you're coming uh, from uh, uh, Kitgum district uh, to this uh, Lamo uh, trading center and the district. And uh, today this is, uh, this is uh, the first place that uh, the national unity platform presidential candidate Robert Chagulanyi uh, had his first uh, rally but uh, it was unique in a kind that uh, he didn't have a fixed uh, venue for his rallies. He just went around town um, waving onto the people and also rallying people uh, to vote for him and uh, from here he's going to be heading uh, to the district of Kitigum where he passed actually when he was coming here but uh, he just went and then refueled his car. Uh, at the moment when we passed Kitigum district uh, there was some heavy deployment because that's uh, his second uh, uh, venue where he's supposed to have uh, his uh, campaign after Lamo district. Now talking about uh, yesterday's events, uh, Robert Chagulany, the National Unity Platform presidential candidate and some of his uh, supporters actually uh, slept in a district in the roadside uh, that's in uh, Otuke. Uh, this uh, this happened um, uh, after Robert Chagulany had a standoff with the security forces. Uh, yesterday he had uh, to go to the districts of uh, Otuke, Kole and Aleptong and after the district of Kole and heading to uh, Aleptong as he passed through Lira district uh, that's where at uh, Ngeta uh, that's where the security forces mounted the roadblock and uh, he was uh, stranded there for close to 11 hours until later in the night when the security forces Forces around uh, 10 p.m. Uh, came and then uh, towed his car up to uh, up to uh, Otuke district and there were some ugly scenes uh, there yesterday uh, evening where some of our colleagues uh, like uh, uh, NTV's uh, uh, Cliff Wamala were assaulted by the police and also someone from the BBC, uh, someone from uh, the BBS as well as uh, some other journalists who got uh, some injuries after uh, they were assaulted by the police. So today so far things are going on smoothly, nothing of a major concern here, nothing of a major confrontation uh, between the security forces and uh, the National Unity Platform uh, presidential candidate Robert Chiaugulanyi. Tomorrow, it's expected that uh, Robert Chiaugulanyi will be resting. Ali Mivlis, my name, back to you in studio.